all the theme browser, the perfect place for those interested in thematic topics to find and refine their story. When you click on the theme tile, it opens up to this screen. Now some of the things that you see here, like these little arrows, may be different on Macintosh machines than on this Windows machine, or they may be missing at all, because you add these functions to the window with some of these controls down below in the pull-down menus. For example, if I take off Your Story, that's just giving me the entire Dramatica structural chart, thematic chart, without any opportunity to make any choices. It allows me to navigate through it by double-clicking and zooming in on areas of interest. And when I do, I can see what's going on more clearly. I can navigate up to a higher level. Or if I go in close, and perhaps even in closer, I can then choose to navigate across this level by clicking up here and moving to a different part of the chart because all of these items that are really in the chart can't be seen at once, so we have to look at a small portion, and we can navigate through that portion just by clicking here, or using your zoom out function, or zoom in function. I'm going to zoom all the way out now. We'll take a look at here. What you've got is a color pattern that's kind of pastel. That's why it says smooth pastel colors. The idea is that you can have rough, high contrast grays, smooth grays, rough pastel, rough vivid colors. I happen to like the smooth pastel, so that's what I have it set for. But this is where you can make that choice. Now you see here that it says term definitions are the only things that are showing. And so, when you click on any item, you get a definition of that item down below. And you can scroll through it simply by clicking here. That'll give you an idea of what all these thematic terms are. But, for extra functionality, you can click on your story, and now something magical happens. All of a sudden, these little arrows appear. And when they do, each is a pull-down menu itself. You click on it, and it allows you to choose how universe a situation will show up in your story. Is the object of story domain, or the main character's domain? Object of story is like the overview, the big story, the big picture of the general on the hill watching the dramatic battle. This is the main character's personal view, the audience position in the story, as if they were one of the foot soldiers. So, does a situation describe best what's going on in the story as a whole, or is it the main character who finds himself or herself trapped in a situation? That's your choice. You know you want to be talking about a situation, but how is it going to show up in the story? Now, just as something of a side note, these colors don't mean anything. They're just there to help differentiate one part of the chart from another. Now, as it turns out, the meanings that are in Dramatica actually could be represented as colors. But that's something for a future version of Dramatica. This version simply uses colors to tell you that you're in mind, which is blues and purples, rather than in universe, which is more yellows and, and light greens.